Alright guys, thanks for coming out and checking out this uh, episode of Space Run. This is uh, my first time ever playing this, so I guess this will be episode fun. Um, looks pretty good, and graphics-wise, I mean, dang, the graphics are pretty clear. Uh, I don't really know anything about this game. I've only seen it played once, so I really don't know what I'm doing. So, thanks for coming out and checking this out, and let's see what we can do. I don't know what my settings are. I don't know where I do anything. I don't know the year is 2525. Space is no longer the final frontier. Mankind is spread out to the farthest reaches of the known galaxy. Those far reaches are dangerous, filled with space pirates, deadly asteroids, and random anomalies. That doesn't mean the people living out there still don't want stuff. That's where I come in. I am Captain Buckman. I pride myself on being the best fracking pilot in the galaxy, if not the universe. Back in the day, I flew for Earth Force. After that, I won the space racing tour three years in a row. Thing is, past accomplishments don't pay today's bills. In order to make some quick cash, I've adapted to the times by becoming a space runner. These days, I deliver packages to the far corners of space. My motto, when you need it there yesterday. Graphics are pretty cool. Great news, Captain Buck, sir. I have picked up a transmission from Outpost Omega 36D. BC, the biggest transport company in the known sectors, is looking to hire space runners. What does that have to do with me? I'm an independent, a lone wolf, a, a maverick. Ah, well, not to cloud the issue with facts, but a glance at your accounts shows you have exactly zero credits. Yeah, I saw that. And I admit, business has been slow. Maybe I need to snap your motto, or a new website. And due to a string of, let's call them, bad breaks, you do owe the mob far more than zero credits. I can't believe the Android Rugby team didn't cover the spread. Okay, I guess I can listen to the offer from BC. I've contacted BC. Their CEO, Susanna Siren, will give you their terms when you reach the outpost. Before our arrival, I want to make sure you understand a few basic features of our ship, so you can live. That's good. That would be good. You can see our ship in the center of the screen. It is composed of hexagonal pieces linked together. You can also see our command bridge. This is where we are standing. It is the core of our ship. No matter what, don't let anything bad happen to this bridge. You can change the view by moving the mouse cursor to an edge of the screen. The view will slide in that direction. You can also use the arrow keys to center the view on your ship when it is off screen. Click on your ship icon. You can also press the space key to center the view. Fast and easy. Good job. Time to hurry a little now. Being fast is the key to becoming rich. Let's build a nice new thruster on the ship. I've activated the tools construction panel for you. Click on it to open it. Look for the small thruster construction. Click on it to select it. Once selected, you can place the thruster on the ship simply by clicking on a valid location. Consider it done! Thruster ready to go! Great! As I am sure you are aware, space is a dangerous place, filled with pirates and asteroids. Let's get ready to take them on. Now the weapon construction panel is activated. Click on it to open it. Select the laser cannon construction by clicking on it. Laser cannons can be oriented before placing by using the mouse wheel. This is very important for your success. Use the mouse wheel to change the orientation, then click on a valid ship location to build your laser cannon. Your wish is my command. This may be as Great job, Captain. You've made me proud. Remember, Weapons shoot automatically when a target comes within their range. 
Every construction you build will require hexnuts. Nothing is free these days. The good news is when you destroy asteroids and other ships, they will usually drop some nice hexnuts for you. Move your mouse over the floating hexnuts to collect them. Due to the volatile nature of our business, constructions are bound to suffer some damage during our trips. If a construction is damaged, you can repair it at the cost of some hexnuts. To repair a construction, click on it. Then, click on the repair action. Adaptation is an important aspect of this job. If you don't need a construction any longer, you can recycle it. To recycle a construction, bring up the action menu of the construction by clicking on it. Then, click on the recycle action. Good job, Captain Boxer. Now that you know the basics, put them to good use to ensure our safe arrival. Remember, if we die, we don't get paid. Right away! Thruster ready to burn! Consider it done. This may be as deep. Buster ready to burn. Wow, can't believe we're alive. I mean, good job. Okay, that was just the tutorial. I got a pretty good idea on how to do it. Mr. Buck, Captain Sir, I have Susanna Siren, the CEO, CFO, and all around head honcho of Big Cargo on the line. Let's not keep the lady waiting. Mr. Mann, thank you for taking my call. She looks evil. Call me Buck. Of course, Buck. I hear you are a bit of a wild card. Hard to control. Buckman. And a general pain in the behind. <laughs> Don't believe everything you hear. I also hear you're the best pilot around. <laughs> okay. Believe some of what you hear. We here at BC pride ourselves on fast, safe delivery. Yeah, I can do that. With emphasis on the fast part. We don't usually hire freelancers, but our demand is very high now. I don't usually work for other people, and my need is very high now. So we're even. Good. So we're on the same page. Yeah, it's not exactly rocket science. You give me crates filled with stuff, then I take them where you want them to go. ASAP. Very good. If the first delivery meets my expectations, there will be more work for you. Good luck, Mr. Man. Wow, Susanna's hot. How do you know? I did not see you take her temperature. Androids. <laughs> I don't... I didn't think so. Where's this button? So, 
BC's my only delivery option. <laughs> Tranquil path. Finish Tranquil Path, okay. Holds the stuff you transport. The more of these that make it to their destination, the more space credits for you. Okay. Sir, we are ready to load cargo onto the ship. Remember, BC prides themselves on fast, safe delivery. Yeah, I know the drill. Click on an icon in the construction panel to grab a piece of cargo. Then, click on an empty space of the ship to place it. So easy, even a human can do it. Oh my gosh. We are ready to rocket and roll. I'll forget you said that. <laughs> let's get this old crate moving. Yeah, let's do that. Alright guys, here we go, real mission. Seems to be fun enough, just as a no-brainer type. Captain Buck, sir. Threat detection radar has been activated. My luck, I'm sure something will pop up soon. Small, but still deadly asteroids are coming towards us. I suggest we prepare quickly. Sometimes I hate being right. Ready for action. I'm just getting nuts just for flying. Okay. Right away. I'm not Ready for action. action. I don't even want to do a small asteroid. I know it's coming. I'm going to it. Aye, my captain. I don't know what that is. Small. Ready for action. You got it. I'm gonna go with an engine as soon as. Ready for I'm action. Consider it done. Thruster ready to go. Nice. This is a small ship, so I don't really... I don't want to recycle it. Can I... Reorient it? Oh my lord! Consider it done. This baby has teeth. Continue. I guess we are. 
Well done, sir. You will be happy to know. Big Cargo has paid you for the delivery. Did Susanna tip? Let's not push it, Captain Buck. I suggest you reinvest some of this newfound wealth into ship improvements. Sure. I'm a firm believer that change is good. Especially when it helps keep me breathing. Excellent. After each successful space run, you should visit the engineering <laughs> section. This is where all the most successful captains go to purchase new modules for their ships. You can also upgrade existing ship features here too. I'm giddy with anticipation. I have been monitoring the airwaves and noticed your reputation is growing. I've always had a rep. Yes, but now your reputation is positive. As your <laughs> reputation continues to grow, I am sure you will be entrusted with more deliveries. Oh, As a bonus, you will have access to more powerful modules and this abilities a, in the engineering guy. section. It's guy. good being me. All right, thanks for coming out and checking out that first episode of Space Run. We're going to go ahead and continue to make more of these episodes because uh, it's kind of fun, actually. I mean, I was enjoying myself. All right, so I'll see you on the next one.